Let's take a closer look, in fact, at the blind resume here. Now, these are three teams vying for an NCAA tournament berth, guys. Team A, the weakest strength of schedule, just one win against the top 50. Team B has the most games against the top 50. Team C, the best RPI and strength of schedule by far. So who are we taking from this group? I'm going with C. I mean, to me, I just look at the SLS strength of schedule, three and six, and obviously their RPA at 35. The numbers look like C to me, Jay. I would probably go see as well. As we reveal actually who these teams are, yeah, Team A is Pitt, wow. Team B, Florida State, BYU. Both of you guys would be going with them. And that raises the larger question, Jay, does the ACC deserve five teams? Here's the interesting thing about it, though. BYU, talk about their wins, are Stanford. Stanford's yeah. on the bubble. Yeah. Okay, they beat Texas. That's their signature win. Whereas you look at Florida State, this is a team they beat UMass. They beat VCU. They have a one-point loss to Florida on the road. And they have... They struggled a little bit in conference, but I would think that the WCC deserves one team, whereas opposed to BYU getting in, where Florida State's a team on the outside looking in. But the fact is that they got to the championship, and they split during the regular season against Gonzaga. True. I think that just gave them the edge for what we see in these numbers. But to me, it's always the eye test. Because if I take the eye test right now, Florida State and Pitt are better than BYU. I agree with you.